So today I will talk about uh, multi homotopy theory of low learning schemes, and this is joint with Federico Binda and Porana Ustvar. And um, so you may wonder uh, why we uh, we need to develop uh, a new multi homotopy theory of low learning schemes. So I will explain our motivation. So um, <clears throat> there are lots of um, non-A1 non invariant homology theories. For example, what homology? H czar um, P X comma omega Q. Um, so say X is a, some some scheme. And then um, the reason is that uh, the reason why this is not A1 invariant is um, H zero of uh, uh, A1 omega zero is uh, just um, say x is over a field k, then this is k of x. Otherwise, on the other hand, h is zero of uh, k omega zero is just k. So they are different, not isomorphic. And, um, and topological, Hock shield homology, Uh, this was defined by uh, Bokstad, and I will review, uh, review the definition later. And topological cyclic homology. TC. And um, are homology with Z mod P uh, it is well known that this is not A1 invariant and find uh, K theory but uh, for K theory, uh, K theory is A1 invariant over for re regular schemes. So X should be non regular for non A1 invariants. And for a type of homology, you assume P to ah, be sorry. a characteristic, right? Right. Sorry. X is uh, a characteristic. So say X is over a field and Characteristic of K is different from uh, is equal to P. And suppose this is positive. So um, the meaning of A1 in non-A1 invariance is H I of X is not isomorphic to H I of X times A1. So for these homology theories, it is uh, not possible to represent these homology theories in SH. So non-representable is in mathematical terminology, uh, uh, is uh, there exists uh, no homology in SH of S such that um, H 
PQ of X is uh, isomorphic to home is H of S, uh, sigma uh, T infinity X plus comma sigma PQ E. For R, X lives in smooth over S. So that's the precise definition. And there exists no such an such a such an E in SH of S for these five homology theories. So um, our motivation is to extend or maybe to define another um, motivic chromotopy category such that these are all representable. So um, I will explain um, what is the problem in SH. So the problem in SH is that A1 is, um, A1 is useful, very useful for developing homotopy theory, but still that's not enough. The fundamental reason is that um, A1 is not compact. So, <clears throat> so um, in algebraic topology, the interval is 0, 0,1. And in um, motivic homotopy theory, the interval is A1 in A1 theory. Uh, and this is 0, 0,1 is compact, but A1 is not compact. And 0, 0,1 is also contractible and A1 is contractible. So um, we want um, a better, a closer replacement. So uh, we want to, so the motivation of our construction is we want to find something which is both compact and contractible. And you may try try for example p1 and this is compact but not contractible and uh, so the picture is like this the Betty realization of a1 is um, c c c is uh, s s2 minus infinity which can be uh, drawn as like this and p1 is um, this S2, which is compact. And 0, 0,1 is like this line. And uh, we can consider 0, 0,1 squared. And this is um, <coughs> homeomorphic to uh, this picture. Not equal, but hope homeomorphic, uh, so boundary at infinity, infinitesimal boundary. So, um, so um, we want to find uh, an analog of the last picture and um, we the, the the idea is uh, we just record the boundary and if we record some boundary then we consider that as an infinitesimal boundary for the top body realization so in this sense we can define this one this one is informally called cubal box this notation is uh, given by just a pair, p1 comma infinity, and we consider infinity as a boundary, and this is compact and contractible. So 
I, I would like to say that this is a closer replacement. And um, so this is not a scheme. This is a scheme with some extra information. And we want to make the category of such pairs. So suppose this is a scheme. Then in uh, SH, when developing SH, we need, need to develop smooth over S. So we similarly develop smooth log smooth over S. Uh, this is the category. Um, category where objects are x comma d and where x is uh, smooth over s and these uh, so we want we don't want some arbitrary arbitrary boundary so this is a strict normal crossing divisor over s And um, morphisms are y comma e to x comma d, um, but um, the the but the we don't we don't have e to d, but we instead have uh, y minus e to x minus d. And we want to make sure that this is commutable. So uh, not e to d. So uh, this is our basic uh, category. So this is a replacement of smooth over s. Okay. And for not for uh, I will introduce the notation. So. If uh, v is equal to x comma d, then um, v underline is just x and boundary denotes d. And I will often abbreviate 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 x comma d by some some another notation for simplicity. Okay, so <coughs> we need to uh, define the replacement of the Nisnevsky topology. So um, and the Nisnevsky topology is, uh, comes from Nisnevsky CD structure. So we can similarly define uh, a strictness in the CD structure. So a strictness in the distinguished square is a Cartesian square y prime y x prime x f g f prime g prime and in 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 this square lives in uh in um smooth low smooth over s such that um F, G, F prime, G prime are, are strict. I will, ex I will def define strict morphisms uh, later. Or strict and the underlying square of schemes is a um, Nisnevsky distinguished square. Okay, and I need to define strict 
So a morphism f from y to x in smooth log smooth over s is strict if f upper star of the Cartier divisor is exactly the boundary of y. <clears throat> okay, and then um, I will uh, abbreviate, abbreviate this topology as a, a strict Nisnevich topology, as Nis topology. Okay, so so far uh, I explained it smooth, low, smooth, and strict Nisnevich topology. And then um, <coughs> I also explained the replacement of A1, but it turns out that that's not enough. Um, so that by some technical issue, that's not enough. So um, we need to replace also AN. So um, regard, so a natural competition of AN is of course um, P1 uh, and S power of P1 or PN, so we, we choose PN because P1, S power of P1 is similar to just P1. So regard uh, P minus one is the hyperplane of Pn at infinity. Okay, and then um, a one n is an open subscheme of Pn, and actually um, we can consider uh, Pn comma Pn minus one, and that, that's also an open subscheme of this smooth low smooth over S. So. And this is a replacement of a n. <clears throat> and um, for notation, I will write p bullet, p bullet minus one is the collection of p n, p n minus one for an integer greater than or equal to one. So for example, Box is uh, P1, P0. Okay, so with all these uh, ingredients, we can define, we can construct log SH, which is our uh, main category. So, definition is that. Um, S is, suppose S is a scheme, <laughs> then uh, log SH S1 of S is given by homotopy category of S1 <coughs> uh, symmetric spectra of simplicial pre sheaves and I will give the local model structure. We first uh, localize, we first consider the SNIS local projective model structure, and we further localize both field localization by P bullet P bullet minus one. So more precisely, both field localization for the all projections P bullet comma P bullet minus one times X to X. And then, the category is over smooth log smooth over S and pointed simply just shifts, pre shifts, and take the spectra and homotopy category. And if you want, you can also take infinity category associated with this model structure. And um, for P1 stabilization, 
we don't replace P1 because P1 is already okay. So log SH of S is the same, but just uh, S1 is P, P1. And this is the ordinary P1 without log structure. I'm sorry? And this P1 is the ordinary P1 without any log structure, right? No, you're correct. No log structure. So P1 is just uh, P1. P1 okay. is P1, comma, empty set. Yeah, thanks. Okay, and um, so notation. So in a one homotopy theory, we 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 use like a p one comma infinity or p one comma one, uh, but that's confusing with our notation because we use the notation for um, recording our boundary. So. So P1, we use something like P1 smash with some point or X smash with some point like that. Some, some say some point, like if X is a point. Um, instead of X comma X like that. Sorry, another question, uh, when you say this I mean, when I take point at uh, pre-shifts, the point is not at the boundary, right? Point should not be right on the boundary. Okay. So more precisely, there should be a map from X to X, uh, but this is naturally factors through uh, X minus boundary X. Okay, yeah, right, thanks. So, the point should live in the op open complement. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so, on, or um, more generally, if y to x is a morphism in smooth low smooth s, then uh, we use this already notation x over y is cofiber of y to x. So in A1 homotopy theory, uh, this is only used, I guess, if this is only used when uh, Y is some sub-scheme of X, I guess. But um, um, in some cases, we should co consider some non-sub-schemes. So for example, in uh, A1 theory, Uh, T is um, A1 modulo GM, and GM is a subscheme of A1. But in our theory, um, we need to uh, compact GM because GM to A1 is not a proper morphism. So uh, our T is A1 modulo a1 comma zero. So there is a map from a1 comma zero to a1 and we can just consider the cofiber of this. And um, one, um, one thing I need to say is that p1 modulo one um, is uh, equivalent, box equivalent to, so, equivalent in log SH is one to T. So you can use T if you want, or you can use P1, of course. Is it equivalent to S1 suspension of something? Um, actually, this is uh, uh, actually without S1 suspension. So actually this is equivalent in log H. No, no, I mean that uh, for A1, um, Homotopy theory, you also have that this is S1 smash GM. Ah. Do you have any kind of the formula that this is S1 smash something else? 
Okay, yes, so um, that also uh, as one smash with P1 command zero plus infinity. Uh, so GM is compactified by P1 command zero plus infinity. Okay, yeah, I see. So in log SH, uh, S1 and S. And um, I also need to say that um, you can also define log H of S or log H uh, S uh, point, but the de definition is different. Um, I, I don't know how to define this one using smooth log smooth. So we need to use, um, I will not introduce this one, so log smooth over S, and also another topology um, called, called dividing the same topology. And, and in this case, we only need to consider a box. You can also consider P black, P black minus one, but they produce the same one. Okay, so um, this is our um, definition of um, construction of low SH. And um, we want some relation between logs, log SH and SH. So omega is a functor from smooth log smooth over S to log smooth over S and X maps to X minus boundary X. Then um, we can define um, Omega lower streak from log SH S to uh, SH of S and also S1 version. So um, So just uh, observe that omega lower streak of uh, um, box is uh, is just um, a one. Omega lower streak of, uh, for example, p one is just uh, p one. So we use the same. We use the compatible uh, localization and stabilization. So and we can construct omega lower streak. And omega first star. So uh, this is the relation. Okay, and then um, so our theory is somehow some another uh, construction. And um, what I want to say today is uh, topological Hochschild homology. Um, so, um, and I will explain how to represent this topological Hochschild homology in log SH when S is a scheme. So, if R is a community ring, or just ring if you want, um, then T H H R is given by uh, the geometric realization of certain diagram H R H R. So I will explain H R H R like that. Like that, and HR is the Ellenberg magnetic spectrum associated with R, and uh, mass BBS uh, is uh, the sphere spectrum. So uh, this definition is due to uh, 
box title. And um, uh, a cyclotomic spec, so definition, a cyclotomic spectrum uh, is on S1 equivalent uh, spectrum. Uh, with maps x to uh, xtcp uh, for prime p. Uh, I will not explain what is tcp. So cp is the cyclic group of order p, and tcp is the Tate uh, Tate uh, uh, related to Tate uh, cohomology. And theorem of uh, Nicolas and Scholte is um, uh, th h is a, a, a cyclotomic spectrum t h h of r. And, and we can define TC from any cyclotomic spectrum. So um, using their work, um, you can define TC of R is TC of THH of R, so this is, um, and, and this is uh, not the original construction. So Nicholas and Schultz also proved that this is, this coincides with, with the original construction is uh, different, but equivalent construction. Uh, um, so the, of the original, Original one is due to uh, Bachstead Fujian medicine. Okay, so and on also um, cyclotomic trace. from K theory R to TC of R. There, um, the box and the medicine also constructed this. And uh, this is a useful tool for computing K theory, especially when R is non-regular. So um, the question we want to address is um, um, how, how can we represent THH and TC um, for uh, in our log SH or log SH is one. So um, we first need to define um, THH for log schemes. So I need to explain that. And before that, to define THH of low schemes, uh, I need to explain um, this one first. So if M is a monoid, um, then this is due to Varthausen. B cyclic, M is uh, given by um, and times Q in simplicial degree Q and I will say uh, what is the D 
degeneracy map. Degeneracy map from Q plus one to Q is given by uh, F zero, F I minus one, F I, F I plus one, F I plus two, F Q, if I is different from Q, and F Q, F zero, uh, F Q, F zero, F one, F Q minus one, if I is equal to Q. And I will omit the uh, degeneracy maps. And this definition is due to Varthausen. This is called cyclic bar construction. Okay. So, <clears throat> and then um, this is due to Wogeness. B repletion of uh, M is B cyclic M group times, ah, so before that, I need to explain uh, what is the map from, um, so there exists B cyclic M to M sending the Q plus one superior degree maps to just the sum. So M is a monoid, so we, we have sum. So, and we consider M as a like, constant simple uh, set. And then we, we, we have B cyclic M group to M group. M group means the group completion of M. And we take the just fiber product. And this is called replete bar construction. Okay, and then uh, we're gonna define the THH for uh, free low rings. So I will explain the definition. So a pre-log ring, a comma M is a ring A with a monoid M and a homomorphism. set up from M to A. And here, regard A as a monoid uh, with respect to the multiplication. And a log ring, it is a log ring if set the inverse of A star to A star is an ISO. And I need to define homomorphisms of p rings. So a homomorphism of p log rings b comma n to a comma m is a commutative diagram. Um, and 
we have a map from N to B and M to A, and we want a map from B to A and N to M to M at this three corner level. So we can form the category of pre loadings. And a homomorphism of loadings is the same as homomorphism of pre loadings. And uh, so, and I should say that there exists a functor from the category of pre loadings to the category of uh, log rings. There is a canonical functor. And um, I will say, I will not denote this one by like a comma ma. So ma of course depends on a, but I will omit uh, this one. Okay. And then um, definition, this is due to wrongness. So if, um, a comma M is a pre low ring. Then THH of A comma M is given by THHA tensor with, I will explain this notation, it's S basically M. SP repletion M. So here S, uh, this one is given by infinite suspension and take plus just uh, another notation. And um, you may wonder when, when, where the tensor product is taken. So you can take the tensor product in the category of E infinity algebra uh, in spectra. Or uh, one can show that S uh, S uh, B cyclic M S B repletion M are cyclotomic spectra E infinity algebra in cyclotomic spectra. In the in, in the infinite category of cyclotomic spectra. So tensor product is uh, taken in the category of E infinity algebra uh, in cyclotomic spectra. Is in this. Or you can also take e tensor in just E infinity algebra in spectra. And they are compatible. So cyclotomic spectra contains just more information. So this part is due to uh, uh, Hasselhort and Schorche. So we have so THH of a comma m is a, a cyclotomic spectrum, and we can define TC of THH. So TC of a comma m is TC of THH A comma M. Okay. So um, if if I if I show that THH is some so so to represent THH in our low SH, we need to extend this THH to low schemes. Because these these are only defined for preloadings up to now. So, and then we want to show that THH satisfies strictly synaptic descent plus p black comma p black minus one invariance. So, um, so um, smooth low smooth is constructed from log rings, not pre log rings. So. We first need uh, this theorem. Uh, Wogness, Sarabe, 
and she need to fire. THH of AM is not equal, of course, but equivalent to uh, THH of A comma MA. So we can uh, forget about pre low rings and we can focus on low rings. And of course, one can show that this is compatible with the uh, cyclotomic structure. So the uh, correct color is TC of A, comma M is also uh, TC of A, comma M, A. Okay, so this is one ingredient to extend to low schemes. And another ingredient is this. So we can construct log SH and that's spectrum T sigma simplicial uh, sheaves strictness navage and P bullet P bullet minus one affine uh, smooth low smooth affine over S. So I need to explain the notations. So uh, SNIS is the, the in, induced topology. So induced topology on smooth low smooth affine and smooth low smooth affine. So, so affine, um, low scheme affine is just um, Log, log rings and just the opposite category of this category. So like affine scheme is opposite category of uh, uh, rings. So commonly rings, so we, we consider this notation and um, so we can consider smooth, low smooth affine and smooth low smooth affine is uh, over S is um, can be considered as uh, like smooth low smooth uh, over S intersection with low scheme alpha. Can you say how a log ring gives rise to a log scheme? Okay. Ah, sorry, sorry. Uh, ah, yes, yes. So, uh, um, so suppose um, example, uh, so um, Z uh, so n squared to Z n squared, for example, or just n, just uh, uh, one maps to a maps to so this is Z x x a. This is a Pre log ring and um, and the boundary is uh, uh, boundary is um, x here. So um, so the one maps to x and this is considered as the boundary divisor. The, so uh, Z n comma n with this uh, homomorphism corresponds to um, A1 comma zero. And we can uh, similarly uh, consider like uh, R comma M, A comma M, and corresponds to a uh, spec a comma um, the divisors. So the, the, the boundary is generated by uh, the image of M to A. Uh, this is not precise if uh, a comma M is not, not not precise uh, if um, 
of course, I only explained uh, smooth, low smooth. If uh, if if non for for non smooth, low smooth, but this is correct for smooth, low smooth. Okay. What do I mean by that? What do I so, mean that this is correct for smooth log smooth? The 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 this writing is correct. Like I mean, is it automatic the divisor is simple normal crossing? Or you need to say something else. Um, if M is uh, a free free monoid. Okay. Ah, so so that's not like automatic. So. Um, so this is for general low scheme. So this gives a low scheme. So this uh, this is in general low scheme, and we want there is some condition on a, a comma m such that that's uh, smooth low smooth. So this is not the always. Uh, so this is not always smooth low smooth. Okay. Yeah. I see. Okay, and then, uh, and we want to define, uh, so I said as SNES is the restriction of SNES, and um, P bullet, so um, T is, was, I define T as a one comma, a one modulo a one comma zero, but these are both, uh, smooth low smooth are fine so we can we don't need to change t but for p1 it, it, it it's some there's some problem and we need to change p1 and for uh, box are fine that's whole limit of uh, gm uh, a one p one minus zero comma infinity, and of course this is uh, equivalent to box, but not not the same, not isomorphic but equivalent. But the the usefulness of box affine is that this uh, is built out of affine things. And we can define um, Pn, Pn minus one are fine. Similarly, we want some um, canonical um, Zalski cover of Pn, and we can make some um, n cube without some point, without some vertex, and we take the core limit of that. But I will omit this. Okay, so I need to explain the proof of this proposition, log SH of S is this. And um, the proof is actually uh, like this. So, shift with uh, uh, strictness language, uh, smooth low, smooth are fine over S uh, is isom equivalent to sheaves with the strictness average uh, smooth low smooth uh, and S. And we can just use this uh, equivalence to uh, construct uh, such an equivalence of uh, categories. So this is the way to extend affine pieces to, uh, to Lower low, smooth low smooth schemes, and then it remains to show that T H is H satisfies as needs descent, and P bullet comma P bullet minus one affine descent. So, uh, proposition T H H satisfies. Uh, Strictly snatch descent. So uh, the proof is like this. 
we reduce to the offline case. Uh, offline. And then we want to show that, uh, so suppose uh, spec, so spec of something is the, uh, the, the functor from the opposite category of low rings to uh, smooth low smooth. So suppose these are uh, in smooth low smooth affine. I suppose this is a, a strict Nisnevsky distinguished square. Suppose. And then in this setting, we want to show that HHC satisfies descent. So we want this THH of A, comma M, THH A prime M prime. THH B comma N, THH of B prime comma N prime. This, this is a, a homotopy, a Cartesian or for Cartesian. So they are just, because spectra is stable. So anyway, So that's the question we want to answer and <coughs> use the previous one, previous theorem of Rogan and Salve strict curve. THH is the same as THH of A comma, M is A comma M A. So um, B comma N, B, so, so B comma M, so M, uh, N A comma B. So these are all strict. So one can show that in from this diagram we, we have B comma M and B comma M A is exactly B comma N. So because of strictness, because strict. So this diagram is somehow a comma m a oh no m is already a logo ring so <coughs> uh, b comma m t h h b prime m t h h a prime m and the question is to show whether this is a uh, Homotopy um, Cartesian or not. And actually, um, so as you can see from the definition, S B C click M B C S B C repetition M is just, just the same. So we can just forget about this. So T H H of A or more precisely this um, THH of B, THH of B prime, THH of A prime is a, a homotopic Cartesian and this is actually known by Bloomberg and Mandel. So this completes the proof of this proposition. Okay. And the, the, the only remaining thing is THH is PN comma PN minus one affine invariant. And then we can deduce that THH is representable.
So proof is that um, because the definition is a little complicated, like we need n cubes. So the proof is the same, but similar, but I will only cover, um, I will only the case when n is one. So in this case, as we, as before, p1, p0 is just um, box. And then um, we call the definition of box affine. So box affine is built out of gm a1, p1 minus 0, comma infinity. And thh of box affine is defined by uh, the homotopy uh, pull, pull, pullback of uh, th of, of this. So so from that picture, th to p1 minus 0 comma infinity and th of gm and th of a1 and th of box affine. So this is defined by the homotopy, the, the pullback of these three. The pullback diagram. And then what we need to show is THH of point is the same as this. That's the question. <clears throat> and then um, that's equivalent. So we can forget about box affine and THH of uh, point is THH of A1, uh, THH of P1 minus zero infinity, THH of GM. And like this one, or just like this one, homotopy push out square, they are equivalent because spectra is a stable infinity category. And this is implied by star point, basically N, B repletion negative N, B cyclic Z is Cartesian. So because lemma is that THH of R or A, A is a ring and M is a monoid and we can define the monoid ring AM and that's THH of A tensor S S uh, B C click M. So using this one, we can just reduce to uh, checking uh, the homotopy, take, checking that the last diagram is Cartesian in the infinity category of spectra. And then I need to recall non computations. So BC click N is star is the union of I greater than one S1 modulo CI. CI is the cyclic group of older I. And C0 is just point. And BC click Z is I in Z. S1 modulo CI. So they are not isomorphic, but they are simply equivalent and more precisely S1 equivalent. There are S1 actions on both sides and the repression N is also this I greater than zero S1 CI and P1 comma P1 minus zero comma infinity somehow um, and 
and p1 minus 0 comma infinity is um, somehow spec of uh, negative n to, so negative n is just isomorphic to n, um, z negative n. So we need negative n here, be re repletion of negative n. So with these computations, uh, this is equivalent to saying that star i less than zero is one c i star i greater than zero is one modulo c i i z is one modulo c i n uh, sorry this is obviously homotopy, this is a push out diagram. So this completes the proof of this theorem. So as a corollary, uh, THH is representable in uh, log SH, S1. And one can show, I can keep track the cyclotomic structure everywhere, all compatible. So this is representable too. So this is the construction of, uh, this shows that THH and TC are representable in log SHS1. And you may wonder whether these are representable in the log SH, just log SH. And of course, uh, we need to define it. So for distinguishment, I will write THH on the line. This is uh, THH comma THH comma THH comma just on infinite uh, uh, copies of THH the parentheses and um, we need to define, so this is a, a P1 spectrum, bonding maps are P1 smash THH to THH or equivalently, we need to set a map from THH to Omega P1 THH H. But actually, this is an equivalence. And this is due to also Bloomberg and Mandel. So we consider their equivalence as our bonding map. And we can define TC similarly and similar bonding maps. And this equivalence is for smooth log smooth schemes. Uh, so equivalence, uh, like more precisely, their theorem is yes, equivalence in smooth log smooth in in, in log SH is one, but their theorem is ex, ex, ah sorry, so I, I I did not mention this, so I I, I should explain this. So so this is equivalence for schemes. And of course, we need to, I need to work, I need to generalize this one to our low smooth, smooth low smooth case and generalize this uh, to smooth low smooth case. And this is possible because the definition of THH of low ring is uh, somehow uh, um, compatible with the monoid structure. So monoid structure is fixed then we can just take tensor product. So this is somehow possible without difficulty. So because um, S times, uh, so X times P1 to X is strict. The projection is strict. So the monoid structure is the same. Okay. So I suppose uh, this is the construction of THH. Then 
Uh, well, uh, I need to, I want to say about K theory. So, So we don't know how to construct hit K theory for log, log SHS for general S. So suppose S is uh, at least regular, at least regular. And then for X smooth over S, K theory of X, X low smooth, smooth, low smooth over S, K theory of X is defined by K theory of the open part. Um, and I would like to emphasize that this is wrong. This should be the, the bad, bad definition. If S is not regular. And I don't know what is the correct definition of K theory in this case. Okay, and then um, our theorem is that unfortunately we need to assume that S is spec K and um, K is perfect field uh, plus uh, resolution of similarities. And then um, in this setting, uh, K theory of uh, K theory of um, I X is uh, home. Uh, log SHS1, uh, simplicer I, and infinite suspension of X plus, and Z cross GR, and of course, I is greater than equal to zero. Integer. Um, it would be really nice if you can remove the assumption that K is a perfect field with resolution to this, but I don't know how to do that. So, Proof is like this. Uh, sing, this is sing A1 of Morel Wojewski. Z cross GR, Grasmania, is a Nisnevici local equivalent to K. K theory, uh, this, this gives K theory. That's uh, due to Morel and Wojewski. So they gave this one as an exercise in their uh, the last part of their paper. And then um, I recall Omega upper star. Omega upper star is SH S one K to SH log SH S one K. So we take omega per star, and we can also show that that gives an equivalence. Seeing A1, Z cross GR is equivalent to omega per star of K. Ah, I was, ah, yes, okay. And then, so I should say that this is same as a K theory of uh, omega upper star of k of x. Okay, and then um, one can show that we can interchange the sin a1 and there is some sin box. Sin box, omega upper star, z cross gr. <coughs> 
So, um, I will explain this one later. And then this is same box, uh, Z cross GR. So, uh, and this is Z cross GR. So these are not trivial, um, just some outline of the proof. Uh, so I need to define sin box. Sin box is a replacement of sin A1 in log SH. So sin, so in simplest degree I, sin box of A, any shift or any pre shift is given by core limit runs over something fy runs over the category of uh, objects. R y two x times uh, box i dot admissible blow up. I will explain this. Uh, after explaining what are morphisms, and morphisms um, y prime x cross box i y. And we also require that y prime to y is an admissible blow up too. This is important. Um, in definition, y to x is an admissible blow up in smooth low smooth if uh, y to underline x is proper and y minus boundary y to x minus boundary y uh, x is um, an isomorphism. So, and um, I should say that um, such a category of miscalculus of left fractions. So, um, this requires, so um, definition is okay, but, um, but we want this theorem F to sin uh, box F uh, is a uh, uh, equivalence in um, log sh uh, is one and uh, sin box f to sin box f times box uh, are simply equivalents. And requires uh, assuming case perfect field plus resolution of similarities. Um, because uh, that when defining this one, uh, we use uh, the fact that this admits characters of left fractions, assuming K is perfect field of resolution of similarities. So, idea is that, idea of the proof is that um, um, this box is not an integral object. In the sense of Moray and Wojewski, we don't have like box times box to box, a suitable multiplication map. But 
we um, avoid this technical difficulty uh, by allow, allowing uh, admissible rocks, but instead, no, no, not, no, not exist. Uh, but we allow the box times box and we allow some admissible blow up, which is a blow up at zero comma infinity plus infinity comma zero, P1 times P1 and uh, comma the two exceptional divisors plus the two boundaries. Two box, and we can define another multiplication, and it somehow so the thing is somehow invert all admissible blobs, so we, one can use this uh, this as a, a, a replacement of the multiplication map, and we can show the theorem. And then. Uh, Definition um, KGM is given by the fiber replacement of Z cross GR. Uh, the fiber replacement, say, B, let B be minus one, Z cross GR, uh, fiber replacement. Z equals GR like that. And bonding maps are um, the user projective bundle formula. So, so again, assume case resolution thing like this. But bonding maps L um, P bullet, P bullet minus one, Z cross GR. Omega P1, L P bullet, P bullet minus one, Z cross GR. And that's Omega per star of K to Omega per star of K, Omega P1. And that's an equivalence by the projective bundle formula uh, for K theory of schemes. So this is an equivalence and this is a bonding map. So this is, uh, so, so KGL is representative in log SH of K if K is perfect field with RS. And then um, the remaining time, uh, I'd like to discuss about orientations. So, um, so, so suppose uh, E is a homotopy commutative uh, ring in log SH and assume S is regular, then on orientation on E is a class uh, C infinity in E to one P infinity and I would like to write this one as P infinity modulo some point. Just so just consider in A1 of the theory, this is just omitted. Uh, whose restriction to C1 restriction is denoted by this one. Uh, P1 uh, is equal to the unit lives in the 
in E, in the common class and P1 smash P1 over one. So, so here E P Q of X is given by home log SH of S sigma infinity P1 X plus comma suspension PQ E. And this is a, a graded comedy ring because E is a homotopic comedy ring. And um, theorem, if E is oriented, then uh, projective on the formula Uh, e in star star P so is as I is zero D minus one E star minus I uh, two I star minus I X where uh, E to X is a rank D bundle. So vector bundle so X is smooth, low smooth, but vector bundle is just strict morphism. Uh, and the strict, the E, e underlying text on the underlying is just the user vectors bundle. And um, tom isomorphism. E star star of E is, again, is the rank D e, e vector bundle. E uh, star plus 2D, star plus D, tom space of E, where tom space of E is uh, E modulo blow up at zero section, E and E is the exceptional divisor. Okay, this is the tom uh, space. And um, E of Grassmannian is uh, E uh, E star star of Grassmannian is E star star point of, so E star star is just uh, E star star point if there is no parenthesis. Former power series ring. And also, um, I can show that um, orientations on E is the set, the set of orientations on E is the there is a one to one correspondence between this one and ring maps from M0 to E, where, uh, so I should say first that this is due to, uh, in A1 home topic theory, Vesozi and over K and Panin. Uh, Pimel of Rondi in A in, in, in A one theory. Uh, where MGL is si similar, like co limit tom space of uh, T R comma N and T R comma N is the tautological bundle. Over the Grassmannian with no log structure, and take the core limit uh, given by this map r comma n to r comma n plus one. There is some map, and we can take core limit and MGL is also some 
um, fiber optic placement of MGL0, MG1, like that. And there is some bonding method. So um, we can prove that. Um, so we can, of course, MGL is a ring, homotopy community ring, and the set of um, ring maps is the same as orientation zone E. So in other words, uh, MGL is the universal oriented homology theory. So I will finish this one with this just one word. So TC, so TC orientable. Then this will give MGL uh, to TC automatically. Um, so uh, thank you very much for your attention and I'd like to stop here. Thank you very much for your nice talk. First question is, uh, so you, you gave here the definition of MGL. Is it compatible with uh, omega upper star of MGL from SH? That's a hard question. So that's true for KGL, I, I explained, but MGL, I don't know. So of course there's a map, but I, I cannot show like, I don't know if it's good to say this is a conjecture or not, but question MGL is equivalent to omega plus star of MGL. That's hard. I, I, at least I don't know how to sh show this. Mm -hmm. Okay, I see, thanks. Any more questions? Um, can you show again the definition of log SH, please, in the very beginning? Okay. Um, so, yes, and um, uh, you said uh, that uh, for log H, uh, it is necessary to use uh, dividing the Snevich topology, but for log SH, it is unnecessary. Uh, it is correct, okay. yes. Yes. And uh, can you um, uh, explain why? Uh, is it enough to use uh, the fact that strictly snevich locally, any point and the boundary of a uh, uh, smooth log smooth schema over a field, um, uh, a neighborhood looks like a neighborhood for related projective space, or there are other geometrical uh, facts which are needed. Mm. So actually, can you explain why uh, dividing the snevich topology is not necessary? Why it can be deduced such a lo locality property? Yes. Okay. So uh, I will explain in, the, in this page. So, uh, so the reason is that um, um, p bullet p minus one local. Uh, plus sitting is Nevich local. Mm -hmm. This is equivalent to uh, D is local plus max uh, uh, local. Mm -hmm. But I could not prove this statement uh, without. Um, so, but after for stable cables. Uh, yes, and what are assumptions uh, on the, uh, uh, what is context? Uh, 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 so for what is base, uh, is it uh, field or uh, not necessary? Over, over a scheme, over- like Over any scheme. Any scheme with a trivial low structure. Mm -hmm. So I, this may be true for stable categories, but so the so uh, like uh, we want to define like log sh of uh, s for general s and we need this and log sh s uh, for the scheme s and both are fine Mm -hmm. But for this purpose, uh, I want to say that this is our uh, 
the, the first definition. And then mm -hmm. for, uh, for scheme S, the, this one is um, another, um, another model. Uh, and the equivalence is only for stable categories, as far as I know. So um, log H should be different. This, this should, should be uh, for, for this one, even for scheme. Mm -hmm. OK, thanks. So, um... So, so, so say again, uh, for log H, the right definition works for any uh, log uh, scheme or uh, mm -hmm. uh, not again. So the definition with dividing this Nevich topology for unstable log H category uh, yeah. works for any log scheme, log based mm -hmm. scheme. Correct. Okay, okay, thanks. Uh, uh -huh. So yes, uh, another question. Mm, let me check. Uh, it is assumed in the definition of smooth log scheme, smooth uh, schemas that underlying uh, schema is smooth, uh, aren't it? Yes. Uh, and uh, now let's take a smooth log smooth schema and an open embedding into a proper smooth log smooth schema. So the left uh, one we can uh, even assume being smooth log smooth affine and the right uh, one now is a, a complication. Uh, what about motifs uh, in uh, log uh, SH category? Is it true that the motif of the complication is equivalent to a one local replacement of the uh, motif of the initial uh, smooth log smooth scanner? Uh, that's that's um, no. So I expect, I believe that. Mm -hmm. like, Motive like motive of uh, uh, so suppose so x is a proper and um, like smooth uh, over s and s is a user scheme and if this is a normal crossing divisor a strict normal crossing divisor then I believe that x comma d motive of this one is uh, should be omega first star of motive of x minus d, which I don't know. Mm. So, and sorry, omega uh, omega star again, it is uh, factor between a1 and box. Uh, yes, omega plus star is sh to low sh. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. so, so we can think about uh, complication of uh, a smooth log smooth affine schema as such a algebra geometric representation of a one localization procedure. Oh, uh, uh. Uh, oh, if x is proper, this is, this really requires x is proper. Okay, okay, yes. Uh, but this is this is wrong if x is not non proper. I believe. Yes, 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 yes. I understand. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, about THH a representability result. Uh, is there a geometric model? That's a hard question. I don't know. Oh. Okay. So, but uh, in, in this context, if, uh, we, if we have some geometric model and if we have a computation of a geometric model, we can expect that this computation is a one uh, local replacement. No, um, oh. because THAT is really uh, something different from A1. So THAT is not A1 invariant. Yes, so yes, yes. It should not come from SH. Yes, yes, and it means it, that it hasn't a proper geometric model. But if we have, for example, maybe a fine geometric model and we can compactify it, then uh, compactification is the same as a one uh, localization uh, of THH. Uh, okay, maybe. Uh, um, well, I so. Uh, so suppose no. So for example, so suppose m x comma d say t h h. Yes, yes. No, no, no. M say uh, some affine say uh, say uh, u. Okay. Uh, but that's not like m x comma d, and I'm I'm not sure whether a one localization of uh, uh, m u. This is. 
I I don't know. It's gonna be I don't know. Oh, okay. Uh, Maybe right. true, but I don't think I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. It's me wrong. So and U here stands for x minus d or not? So U U is x x minus d. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay. Uh, okay, thank you. Uh, and um, also one technical question about classes of admissible blow-ups and proper log et al monomorphisms. Can you say me the relation between these classes in general and in under the assumption of resolution of singularities? Uh, uh, actually, <laughs> is it true that one class is contained in another and uh, uh, is there, uh, can we decompose morphism from one cl class uh, uh, by morphisms from another classes under some initial assumptions? Actually, what, what, what can you compare these classes and what, what are known facts? Yes, so log of modification is the same as a proper log term surjective, proper log term mm -hmm. Yes. Always, if I, I guess I don't remember the correct condition, but probably the quasi compact assumption on some some base, I guess. Okay. So they are just equal. Ah, uh, but sorry, log modification. I uh, uh, <laughs> what is this? Actually, I I hear it only about determining admissible blow up. Ah, no, 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 sorry, sorry. no, 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 no. Uh, <laughs> Sorry. So this is uh, uh, log mod. So this is contained in um, admissible blocks, uh -huh. but not equal. Mm -hmm. And can we decompose somehow admissible blob in uh, in such uh, morphisms uh, under assumption of resolution of singularities or not? No, we cannot. Uh, decompose admissible blobs into subjective proper log and monomorphisms. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. These are admissible mm -hmm. blobs are much more general. Mm -hmm. I understand. Okay, thank you. Uh, okay, thank you. Yes. I have also another one question. Uh, do you have uh, any duality theory for log SH? Uh, um, I, I'm not optimistic about your theory. So, um, actually, um, there is no theory. So, uh, I guess, so if you see uh, motifs with modular three, uh, by Kan Saito Miyazaki Yamazaki, then um then there is some possible like some evidence that uh, their category of modulus their modulus categories not realizable not rigid and i expect the same is true for our log sh so um i my expectation is that uh, log sh is not rigid Unfortunately, mm -hmm. I see. But of course, we can consider some subcategory of full subcategory of uh, strongly generalizable objects. Yes. Uh, do you know whether any? I mean, whether x comma d is fully strongly generalizable? Like, um, probably omega upper star of uh, sh. The image of essential image of this one is dual algebra. I don't know, but this is I expect that this is dual algebra. Mm -hmm. 